To create a genuine cycle, that means a bottle is made into another bottle, the sorted plastic fractions need further processing. Systec Plastics in Thuringia is doing just that at a special plant in the town of Eisfeld. First, HDPE bottles end up here in a shredder. The resulting plastic shreds are cleaned of any shampoo, yogurt, or any other residue. And a special procedure sorts out the last unwanted remains. The result is a colorful mixture of cleaned flakes that are made almost entirely out of HDPE. These still have to be sorted out by color. If they were melted down as is, they'd turn a dirty gray. This color sorting takes place in a special sorter. Special mechanics allow the machine to isolate single flakes from a large mass. HDPE particles are run over a slide piece by piece. Tens of thousands per minute. LEDs light up the material stream while sensors recognize the different colors. The data is analyzed by a computer which controls a panel fitted with more than 60 compressed air nozzles. A blast of air shoots out the unwanted colors. Only the colorless flakes remain if so desired. After this process is carried out over the first two slides, it's repeated on the next two and a final repetition on the last one. The result is an output of 800 kilograms of sorted HDPE flakes per hour with a purity level well above 99%. The material is melted at 220 degrees Celsius in an extruder. The melt is pressed through a filter and once again purified. Then the liquefied plastic is cooled and processed into granules. The result is a high quality raw material that is put to use nearly everywhere in the plastics industry. Besides HDPE packaging, polypropylene or PP caps are put through these elaborate cleaning, sorting and processing stages as well. Every year, around 20,000 tons of material from the yellow sack is processed here in Eisfeld. But only a small portion gets the full treatment. Production capacity is set to increase in the future, and the procedure is to be further improved.